There's a trend right now where you put a water dropper on a camera to create a DIY macro lens. And while I can confirm this does in fact work, I was curious, how macro can you get with this? You see, I had a theory that since this is basically the same principles used in a water droplet magnifying glass, the smaller the droplet you can get, the more macro you should be able to go. So that's what I'm doing today. Okay, so I've got this little water dropper thing, so then that way we can precisely place the water drops on the lens. I set up my camera and set the smallest droplet of water I possibly could on the lens. To make sure I could see what the camera was seeing, I carefully flipped the phone upside down so I could see the screen. Now for the subject, I decided to just use my hand, but when I started shooting, I realized how shaky this whole thing was. After fumbling for around 20 minutes to get a decent shot, this is the result. I'd say that looks pretty macro.